Hi, today we're going to look into ways to stretch out your lower back, especially when you are experiencing back pain. So this exercise is going to be very gentle. The reason being that if you are in pain, you should do it very cautiously, slowly and carefully. When stretching out your back, it's important to remember that muscles that are cramping and are tense are going to take about 30 seconds to stretch out fully. So you need to take your time, okay? The one thing you'll need is a pillow. It's very important when you've got a bad back that you support your head and your neck when doing this. I'm gonna use one pillow today, but if you're a little bit round-shouldered, you might need to have two. So make sure your head and neck are fully supported when you do this. So you can do this either on a mat like I am, but if your back's bad, you'll probably prefer to do it on a bed because it's easier to get on and off a bed than it is up from off the floor if your back's bad. So I'm gonna lie down, keeping your knees up. Make sure you're comfortable. If your back's bad, make sure you bring up one knee at a time. Don't do both together because your back may go into spasm. So I'm going to bring up the first knee and then if I feel able to, I'm going to bring up the second knee. I've got a loose hold and I'm just going to keep my knees in this position. To mobilise your back, you can gently rock your knees from side to side. It may not look as though this is very strong as an exercise, but it's a wonderful way to mobilize your back, especially first thing in the morning before you even get out of bed. So gentle rocking to and fro. If you feel able to, you can then bring your knees further into your chest. You can even cross your arms. Again, my neck is completely relaxed. I'm not pulling forwards at all. Your upper shoulders should all be relaxed. I'm then just gonna hold that and bring the knees in a little bit more, slowing all the time, just tightening and tightening and tightening that hold. When you get there, the secret is to hold it and count to 30, because we really want time for your back muscles to stretch out and for nice fluid to have time to go into the discs and really give the back some ease. After counting to 30, just relax your grip and go back to neutral. Return to your knee rolls. Again, no more than kind of 20 to 30 degrees. And when you have finished that, you're gonna let one leg down at a time so that your back is supported before you put down the next leg. So that's the stretch for today. Just remember, take your time. It's very easy to want to think that the harder you pull your knees to your chest, the more effective the stretch will be. When you've got a bad back, that's not the case. You can actually make the muscles cramp up even more. So take your time, count to 30, and a slow 30, not a quick 30, and then hopefully you'll feel a lot better. Cheerio.